welcome to raw youtube channel so today i am going to show you how to use hyperlink option in nmax access to link records so um, i'll explain this option with my uh, search as you type text box so this is a video i have earlier explained so in this search as you type text box in microsoft access so in this case, I want to open a specific record when I search, for example, here, I'm going to search a name called Saman. So now I want to open this record in a data entry form. So that is what I want to do. So I'm going to open the specific records via hyperlink. So today I'm explain you how to create a hyperlink to open uh, the specific record in a data entry form so um, before go to the video do not forget to subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos like this then uh, i'll explain you step by step how to do this now for example if i want to open the uh, data entry form for the specific records i have to click somewhere else so i'm going to click this i mean the id i click on the id uh, then it will open uh, rate and form according to this method so uh, first of all you need to go to design view once you are in design view what you should do is you have to click on this text box okay you have to click on this text box in uh, design view then Mm, you need to go to uh, property sheet relevant to this text box so when you go to uh, property sheet under the format you can see that's option called is hyperlink by default it is assigned no so here you know you need to change no to yes now is hyperlink yeah now i enabled by adding yes now i want to give reference uh, or a target a location for this hyperlink so it is here you can see under this you can see option called hyperlink target so uh, for the for hyperlink target what you should do is so relevant form i want to open after click this uh, text is A foreign name so this is the form i want to open when i click the specific record so therefore here i want to give name of this form under the uh, type link tag so therefore the name of this one is forms Now you see, uh, relevant to this text box is hyperlink, it says to yes, and I have given the uh, hyperlink target. Then you need to go to the main form, so under the main form. I want to in the text box here. So this uh, text box is to display the ID. Yes, now I added the ID. Then I want to uh, go to properties. Then here under the format, I want to uh, make the this one also hyperlink. So this is data entry form. So then I set the uh, this text box to so hyperlink. Now I want to add a small uh, we be called after this so then i am going to open this frm search form mm, and i want to go to design view so on design view just select this text box right click and select build event then select call builder so once you do this uh, you can see uh, private sub 
and we click uh, event open for that uh, text box then I want to keep it small I want to write a small call so my call this if not null in dot id close brackets then I will give my variable then my variable name is str id then str id as what as string then str id equals b dot id then do cmd dot open form the form is name is frm name so that is target for this target form where i want to open out click on that hyperlink then id Right. Then in this now code in part is okay. Now this is the code you need to add to work this code uh, this uh, hyperlink process. Now go to the access database again, then go to the design view. Now search specific record, just say someone. Now this is the record I look for so I want to open this recording in any form so to do this what I should do is I want to click on this ID so once I click on the ID you can see relevant record opens in data entry form so just say if I type another name type another so yeah I want to open this record also in data entry form uh, so it is a review what you should do is just click on this number the hyperlink then the relevant record will open in end data entry form so this is how you can work with data entry form using hyperlink it's actually a very smart method so let's try uh, you also try this so if you need uh, clarification regarding this process please put a comment under the video comment section and also do not forget to subscribe our YouTube channel for more videos like this one. Okay, thank you very much.